Doctor Who, The Seeds of Death, Episode 3, Solar Power Storeroom. Phillips, hello, Earth Control, this is Moonbase. Emergency, emergency, can you hear me? Rocket, Zomi, at our present rate of drift and allowing the usual gravitational influences, we be drawn into the heart of the sun, approximately five months and ten days. Jamie, no need to worry about that then. Jamie, Zomi, what do you mean? Jimmy, well, we've only got enough food and water for three days, remember? The doctor hears something over his headset. Doctor, just a minute, I think I'm getting something. Phillips, hello, Earth Control, this is Moonbase, emergency, emergency. Can you hear me? Doctor, hello, Moonbase, can you hear me? Solar energy storeroom. Phillips, yes, yes, I can hear you. Loud and clear. What part of Earth are you speaking from, Doctor? O.C. We're not on Earth. We're, we're in a rocket orbit in the moon. Phillips, a rocket? But it's impossible. Rocket Doctor. Well, I can assure you it's not impossible. What's your emergency? What's happening on the moon base? Phillips, O.C. We've been invaded. Aliens have taken over. Team at moon base control. Cully. Put that cover back on, right? Let's test it now. First one. Do you really need to work, think it'll work? Kelly, no reason why not. Replace the overhead circuits. It should be alright. Turn on the power. Hold it. Kelly adjusts something near the monitor. Kelly, try again. We'll team back to Earth and report to Commander Rendor. Sahara, stop. You will remain here. Ice warriors hem them in. First of all, don't move. Do exactly as they say. Technician runs the team at cubicle. Gets killed. The other tackles the warrior and also dies. Sahara. You remain here. Team Matt Earth Control. Rendor. Brett. Has contact been re-established with moon base yet? Brett. No, sir. No. As soon as Miss Kelly has transmitted the emergency link, switched off again. Alfred. You have no idea what happened? Brett. Oh, I'm sure Miss Kelly will sort things out all right. Rendor, I wish I had your optimism, your optimism. Rocket, Doctor, how much longer, Zoe? Saying, well, our orbit will bring us back into his range approximately 46, three seconds. Doctor, let's hope we can still, he can still transmit. Zoe, this is signal, is, his signal is quite strong. When we orbit in this, this side of the moon, there's no reason for it to fade, Doctor. It's not his equipment I'm worried about, it's his survival. Sorry, Doctor. These aliens, he describes, Zoe, how much did you hear? Zoe, bipeds, reptilian, armed and some kind of sonic device. Jamie, yes, ice warriors. Zoe, what? Doctor, yes, yes, Jamie. I have met them, uh, I have met them before. They come from the planet Mars. Zoe, well, what do they want? Doctor, Mars is a dying planet. Imagine they're trying to find a new home. Zoe, why the moon? Doctor, oh, I think. It's just a stepping stone. Zoe, would you, would you, did you, they were ice warriors? Jamie, yes. Doctor, yes. Well, Mars, as you know, is a cold planet. Adapted to that. It's heat they can't stand, Zoe. We're just about to be coming into range now, Doctor. Hello, Moonbase. Hello, Moonbase. Can you hear me? Phillips, yes, I can read you loud and clear. Doctor, oh, thanks heavens for that. Now listen, we need your help to, to make a landing. Phillips, but you mustn't land. You must warn Earth. What about what happened before here? Doctor, we can't do that. We lost radio contact with the Earth. Felix, well, then go back and warn them. Doctor, we can't do that either. We haven't got enough fuel. We need to fill the fuel to get to the fuel dump on the moon. Felix, but they'll kill you. Doctor, oh well, we just have to take the risks. Now, where are you, mister, or what? Felix, Felix, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in the solar energy store now what do you want me to do Do sorry doctor if we could if we could adapt our homing equipment to the radio signal the beam into on that doctor do you hear that you want you to keep your transmitter going phillips you see you're right i'll try but i've no idea how long the transmitter can last doctor fastness and wires together doctor there i think i've done it now then let's see if i can pick up this signal beep beep Doctor, yes, there they, here we are. Zoe. 
What about the t- approach t- treachery? So, yes, he- here, Doctor. Oh, good, this. I don't think I could have done better myself, Tommy. We need to fire the retro rockets in 17.5 seconds, Doctor. What? Where any positions, everyone? There's, they turn the seats around. Dot, sorry, two seconds, one, two, one now. Doctor flicks a retro rocket switch. The craft turns its head tail first to the moon. Sorry, let's hope there's enough fuel left to cushion down on. Jamie, aye, let's hope the radio beam doesn't conk out before we get there. Doctor, don't worry, Jamie. I'm sure we're, we're going to be all right. Jamie, yes, Ice Warriors. Sorry, what? Doctor, yes. Jamie and I met them before. They came from the planet Mars. Say, well, what do they want, Doctor? Mars is a dying planet. Imagine they're trying to find a new home. Doctor, sorry, why the moon? Doctor, I think that's just a stepping stone. Sorry. What, what, what did you, they were? Ice Warriors. Jamie, yes, Doctor. 
Yes, Mars, as you know, is a cold planet. We adapted for it to it. The heat they can't stand, Zoe. We should just about be coming into range now, Doctor. Hello, Moonbase. Hello, Moonbase. Can you read me? Fitz. Yes, I read you loud and clear, Doctor. But oh, thank heaven for that. Now listen, we need you help to make a landing, Dot Phillips. You can't, mustn't land. You mustn't work on Earth. But what's happened here, Doctor? We can't do that. We've lost radio contact with the Earth. Fitz, well, then go back and warn them, Doctor. We can't do that either. We haven't got enough fuel. We need to do, get the fuel dump on the moon. Fitz, but they'll, they'll kill you, Fitz, Doctor. Oh well, we have to take that risk. Where are you, mister? Ah, oh, what? Phillips, Phillips, I'm in the solar energy store. Now what do you want me to do? Sorry, Doctor. We could adapt our homing equipment to his radio signal. He could beam in on that. Doctor, do you hear that? He wants you to keep your transmitter going. Phillips, oh, 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 see, oh, right. I'll try, but I've no idea how long this transmitter can last. The Doctor fastens some wires together. Doctor, there, I think that's done it. Now then, let's see if I can pick up this signal. Beep, beep, beep. Doctor, yes, there we are, Zoe. What about the approach trajectory? Zoe, yes, here. Doctor, oh, good. Oh, yes, I don't think I've done better myself. Zoe, we need to fire the retro rockets in 17.5 seconds. Doctor, what? Well, landing positions, everyone. They turn their seats around. Zoe, two seconds, one now. Doctor flicks a retro rocket switch and the craft turns the head tail first for the moon. Zoe, let's hope there's enough fuel left to cushion down. Zoe, Jamie, I, let's hope the radio beam thing doesn't conk out before we get there. Doctor, don't worry, Jamie. I'm sure we're going to be all right. Solar energy Storeroom. Fitz, hello, Moon Rocket. Can you hear me? Doctor, hello, Moon Bo- Rocket Bo- Base. Yes, Cam, we're coming in on your signal now. Whatever you do, keep transmitting. One of the diodes on the top of the transmitter goes out. Of course. Rocket, Doctor. This signal is, it's stopped. Sorry. Can you get us back into orbit? Doctor, no, no. I shall have to get us down as best I can. Sorry. But if we crash into the moon, mountain range, we're smashed to pieces. If we smash the pieces, that Phillips replaces the file doll. Zoe, it's working again. Doctor, can you look on back onto it? Doctor, well, I'll try. Yes, that, there it is. Oh, I would. I think we're going to be all right. Tire craft comes down vertically with a moon base pad. It's, and it's, and it's, we have something of a bump. Doctor, yes, well, I'm sorry about the landing. Is everything, buddy, everyone all right? To me, I, well, we down. That's the main thing. Doctor, yes. Sorry. Now, what do we do? Doctor, well, the first we must, first we must do is to refuel. Can you see to that, Zoe? Can't you? Zoe, yes. What's, what are we going to do? Doctor, well, I must go in search for Mr. Phillips. Zoe, but what about the white warriors? Doctor, ah, oh, I meet them before, met them before. Zoe, but doctor, you can't, you mustn't, just can't go. Doctor, We've got to rescue Mr. Phillips now, haven't I? Now, where did I put that map on? Ah, here we are. Right then, the solar panel room is... Here we are. Yeah, oh, yes, yes, that seems to be quite a simple route. Do you right, I'll come with you, Damien. Doctor, no, you stay here and look after Zoe. You don't worry, we're going to be quite all right. Jamie, ah. Doctor, good luck, Zoe and you. Jamie, and to you, the doctor leaves the capsule. Jamie, well now, how do you feel? Zoe, well, well, that's simple. I connect automatically from here. Now, watch this doll. I'll make it feel, 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 you feel, switch it off. Now, do you think you can remember that? Jamie, of course I can. Zoe, good. I want to make a look, have a look at rocket motors. Zoe? Zoe, I want to have a look at the rocket motors. Jamie, why? What's the matter? Zoe, well, I don't think much like the way we landed. It might have caused some damage there. So, Jamie, oh, well. Well, I know it's a bit rough, but surely not as bad as all that. Jamie helps her down. I let it surface later. Sorry, well, it's not the landing that matters. Now it's the takeoff. Team at Moonbase Control. Fersham is pressing buttons next to the city names. Fersham, Tokyo, London, Cambria. 
That's the lot. The whole system's completely operational again. Sahara, we now send, you can now, we can now send to any city in the world. Fersham, yes, anywhere, anywhere is a team at centre. Kelly, Fersham, do you realise what you're doing? Fersham, I'm trying to save our lives. Kelly, all about the people of Earth. Fersham, we're in a position to, we're in no position to argue. Kelly, why would you want to control Team Matt? If you're going to invade Earth, you'll be, you'll be fighting the armed forces of the entire world. You never succeed in too much resistance. So, Sahara, there will be no resistance. Fersham, what, what about us? What's happened to, uh, what happened to us? Say how you remain alive as long as you're useful. Kelly, you never get any help from me. So, how? Then the time comes, you'll do exactly what you're told or die. Solar energy storeroom. The doctor sneaks down corridors, following his map. He taps on the store door, room door and enters. Doctor, hello. Phillips comes out from behind a box, wrench in hand. Phillips, who are you? Doctor, ah, Mr. Phillips, I presume. Phillips, yes. Where have you come from? Doctor, from the rocket. We're talking, we're talking the radio. Fitz, thank heavens you've made it. Oh, there are others here too. Doctor, no, they're still in the locket, rocket. How many ice warriors are there? Fitz, these creatures, those creatures you mean? Doctor, yes, Fitz. Well, there aren't many, but they're deadly. Doctor, they're on, ah, oh, they have weak, they have their weak points. Fitz, do, Fitz look, they've killed everyone already here. Oh, except first of he's helping them. Doctor, I see. Well, there's one thing for it. You should have to destroy the team, Matt. Phillips, right, what? Rocket. Jamie, are you right, Doctor? Doctor, yes. O- Doctor OC, yes, we have refueled the, have you refueled the rocket, Jamie? Jamie, we have just finished and Zoe checking the rocket motors. Doctor OC, oh, very good. I have found Mr. Phillips. Jamie, how is she? How is he? Doctor OC, oh, he's quite all right, but Jamie, I, you're bringing him back. Bring, bringing him back now? Oh, see, yes, eventually, Jamie. Oh, but I have got to put the team out of action first. Jamie, but, doc, but do, Doctor, what about the Ice Warriors, do, Doctor? Oh, see. Now, don't worry, Jamie. You and Zoe prepare the rocket to take off and wait for us. Goodbye. Doctor, Jamie, but Doctor, Doctor, oh, hey, ouch. Jamie climbs up to, Zoe climbs up into the capsule. Jamie, what was that the doc- Jamie? That was the doctor. He's found Phillips. He wants to prepare the rocket to take off. Well, they put the team match out of action. Zoe, but he can't. Zoe, why? I just, Zoe, I che- just check the main power drive. The rocket motor is completely useless. Jamie, what? The only way back to Earth is by team map. Jamie, oh. Zoe, doctor, doctor, can you hear me? This is Zoe, doctor. Oh, he must have switched off, Zoe. Oh, now what do we do? So we go and find him. Come on. Do- home base corridor, Doctor. Where is this heading leading to? Felix controls head quarters. Through this way. Round the corner they see a warrior. With Kelly in its painful grass. Doctor, it's a nice warrior. It's got Miss Kelly, but how? The warrior aims its weapon at them. Doctor run. Phillips and the doctor run in different ways. Kelly gets free the warrior and runs off to Phillips. The doctor appears and tackles the warrior before, before looking, leading it off a diversion through various corridors. Just as he thinks he's lost it, two more in front of him. He runs back through an area of mirrored panels across lots of reflections until he's trapped in front of a locked door. Doctor, stop. Warrior, you must be destroyed. Doctor, you've got no oil just to kill me. Your leader will want to speak to me. Warrior, humans are our enemies. Doctor, but I can be useful to you. I first show your leader will be angry if you kill me. I'm a genius. Well, warrior, genius? You'll come with me. Come with me. Meanwhile, Jamie and Zoe don't have the benefit of the map. Jamie, now which way? Zoe, I don't know. I'm lost. Jamie, I thought you knew the way. Zoe, so did I. Take the, try, try, let's try this way. Jamie, woman. I come to another junction. Jamie? Oh um, no, we've just wandered around here all day. We could wander around here all day, Zoe. Look. Listen, quick here. They hide behind a tension. A warrior comes past. Zoe, what is, what was that thing? Jamie, an ice warrior. You see, we were right. Warrior turns. Jamie, quick run. Jamie and Zoe run for another corridor and hide again. Zoe, get back. Don't move. The warrior looks down the corridor and takes them another one. Zoe, Jamie, now, now what do we do? 
So we keep looking for the doctor. Keep our eyes open for solar energy room. Come on, Jamie, solar power. Team at Moon Base Control, Fersham. I wish you'd tell me what you want me to do, Sahara. You would shortly dispatch a cargo to certain cities on the Earth, include Adonis, Oslo, Stockholm, Hamburg. Fersham, cargo? What sort of cargo? The doctor has entered with the doctor. Warrior, the prisoner Kelly has escaped. His human has, was in the corridors. Sahara, who are you? Where, where are you from? Doctor, I might ask you the same questions. Ah, you will find that you will find the human Kelly and bring her here back, back here. Who is this man who wore a lead? First him. He's not one of the crew. I don't know him. He must have arrived here. Just arrived here. So ah, impossible you could have T-Mat. How did you get here? Doctor, all the resources are not limited to T-Mat, you know. So ah, you arrived here by other means, by space rocket. First him, rockets have been, not been used for years. Ah. Then you're lying. You've been concealed here all the time, Doctor. But you can't be sure of that, can you? The people of Earth may be preparing a whole fleet of rockets to defend themselves against, to defend themselves with. For I know Earth relies on Tony and T-Mat. There's no defence against our plans, Doctor. And what are your plans? Evasion by T-Mat? There are too many of you to conquer all the peoples of the world. Two warriors carry a creek container. I put between them. My, my warrior, the Moran Marshal, has ordered us all the seeds to be prepared. Be prepared. You are, you are to receive our instructions. Further than the guard, the humans, if they try to escape, kill them. Tara leaves. The warriors stay busy themselves. Containers, so the doctor speaks quietly to Fersham. Doctor, why are you helping them? Fersham, I've seen what they can do. Doctor, do you know what is in that container? First of all, all I know is they want me to send it some fi- to some something to this earth for T Mat. I suppose that's what's what that uh, I suppose that's what's in it. But I shall have to look take a look inside. Are you gonna help me? Solo energy storeroom. The doctor's been captured but don't but you can't but you can't help him, Professor, so I'm sorry. Nothing we could do, Jamie, of Kelly. We had a job to reach out here ourselves, so Jamie. Uh, I, so did we. So are you sure the Ice Warriors don't know about this place? Phillips, well, one of them did find it. I managed to deal with him. So he how Phillips, well, he fixed up a kind of booby trap to sell the energy in the power line, Jamie. Ah, Kelly, by the look of these things, I have, have been, f- by the look of these things, I've been, I have, through. They are vulnerable. Doctor, they know the doctor said they can't stand heat. Jamie, aye, that's right. Fits the heating system, the entire base is controlled from the centre. Now we can reach, when we can reach the controls, we turn up the heating. Sorry, but how can we get there? There are ice warriors patrolling these corridors. Jamie, aye, Fits, yes, I know, the maintenance room and tunnels over here and over here. Go on the wall, Jamie. Hey, if you could get through the here, they'd turn the heating up, knock the warriors out, we could rescue the doctor. Kelly and team at themselves out back. Kelly and team met ourselves back to Earth. Jimmy, I. Sorry, but I thought the team met was broken. Kelly, not anymore, repaired it. But how can we get this cover off? Fitz, and this is part of the base. This part of the base hasn't been used for ages. It's trusted solid. It'll take some time. Jimmy, I. Well, the doctor may not have much time. Team at con- moon base control. Doctor. All right, Fersham, now. Fersham, I can't. They us both, Doctor. You've got to help me. Fersham, I can't. I said I can't. Doctor, very well, I should do it myself. If I'm caught, which more likely we both get killed. Fersham, all right. Fersham walks past the warrior. Warrior, do not move. Fersham, I was ordered to prepare the controls for transition. I have got to check that everything is in order. Warrior, run and turn to where you were. The doctor sneaks out over to the container. Fersham, but this is very most important. Warrior, if you're trying to escape, I should destroy you. Fersham, I'm not trying to escape, warrior. Go back to where you were. Fersham, all right, all right. The warrior sees the doctor at the container. We hear it slams shut. The doctor turns, raises his hand, so hard, wait. Open it, I said open it. The container is full of six-inch spears. Doctor, what are these things? He picks one up. 
They look like seed pods. A pod that suddenly expands, goes pop, and the doctor coughs on the tiny particles it releases. He collapses. First thing, what is it? What happened to him? Is he dead? Thor, energy room. Thor, solo energy storeroom. Fair, and Jamie work at the opening of the grill. A maintenance tunnel. Zoe listens at the door. Jamie, that's it. Sorry, I think I've heard something. So, Kelly, be careful. So he opens the door and looks out to see a warrior in the corridor. Jamie, Zoe, that, that is one coming. I don't, I don't think he saw me. Jamie, we won't take any chances. Jamie, James and Battle Bar across the side of the door. Jamie, that should hold it. Zoe, get back. Everyone hides. Phillips, don't move. Jamie, the booby trap thing. Does it really still work? Phillips, it will ha it'll have to be connected. Jay, well, come on, Phillips, Miss Kelly. Kelly plugs the infrared lamps back into the extension cable. Phillips, sorry, sorry, hands him the power plug. Phillips plugs the ray into the solar power line. Phillips, right. Jamie goes back to the door handle. A warrior enters. Kelly, now. Phillips throws a switch. And a few seconds later, the new do another dodgy mark on the floor. Team at moon base control. A warrior carries a seat towards Team at. So how are you prepared to activate this cubicle? Transmit to London, the bay, Fersham sits at the controls. Team met of control, computer, emergency transport systems, they are in operation. However, situation is still extremely critical in most parts of the world. Primitive areas surviving best, but all major cities now suffering few, severe food shortages. And all that team met, millions are going to die, especially in the cities. Team at moon base control, Sahara activate. A sea pot and its, and its elegant stand vanish. Team at earth control and appear. No one notices until the vice chimes spent. Went. Commander Rendor, the Mac team at is working. Rendor. Working? Kelly okay, must have got through. Alfred Spendlin, what is it? Brent opens the cubicle and touches the pod. It swells up. Brent is alive. The pod continues to swell.